And now, sadly, we come to the final act, our final farewell participation. But before we do that, Marilyn, Scott, and I, we want to thank you all for attending this event this evening and supporting our society. And of course, please join me in thanking your Unball Committee listed in your program, but special mention to the hardest workers, Margot Pollock, our Executive Director, Sarah Lackey, who managed ticketing and all of our communications, our producer, Catherine Doyle, and of course, our patient video editor, Peter Machulina. We hope you enjoyed it as much as we did in pulling it together. And again, we appreciate the participation of many friends from afar. And for the, and for the ones that are five, five hours ahead in the UK, we're now perfectly in sync with our usual wind up at two in the morning. A reminder that our ball is but one of our many events, but certainly a big one for us. It highlights three of our important objectives as a society. Firstly, creating social occasions to bring our members together and strengthen our community. Secondly, of course, celebrating Scottish heritage and our love of Scottish culture. And thirdly, and perhaps most importantly, raising funds to support a range of worthwhile community causes connected to our community and heritage. You've all been extremely generous in your participation and donations. And proceeds from this evening will go not only to support our many community causes, but also to support the important work of a major Montreal mental health institution, the Douglas Hospital, represented this evening by the foundation director, Laura Fish, and I know many of the board members. The beautiful campus of the Douglas is also a regular host of our summer Montreal Highland Games, and we look forward to being back there. So a very heartfelt thanks to all of our donors, especially our patron and Tartan supporters, all of whom listed in the program, who make this valuable support possible. And so with that, good night to all, wishing you all very good health in the year ahead and looking forward to being together in person at our 2021 ball. And remember what the Scots say, keep your heed and slange of awe. And now we close the evening with our customary tradition, singing Auld Lang Syne. And so I want you all to open your microphones and join us in a hearty rendition, or perhaps more likely a global cacophony of <laughs> Auld Lang Syne. And we're going to have some background in inspiration to give you a reminder of how great it will be to finally be together, singing together, shoulder to shoulder. I think our great baritone Scott McKenzie is going to lead us away. It's called Lang Syne. Yeah. Yeah.